actually I think I'm going to talk about my favourite favorite Disney films of all times with dogs in it and you know it's not going to be if you guess I'll give you one guess I had a cuddly teddy of one of the characters but just not you now but they um oh well anyway I can't show you the cuddly teddy but anyway you you would be surprised live action 101 Dalmatians DVD and 102 Dalmatians on DVD. Now I like these, but my favourite one has to be the first one in live action. They did a pretty good job. But 102 was much more my favourite, really, compared to the 101, because I found that kind of sick. I mean, all those dead animals they used as fur was kind of sad. It's like Fox and the Hounds, you know, you get the picture, but it's kind of cool. It has that Fox and the Hound feel to it. But the second one was my favourite. 102 Dalmatians. This one is definitely my favourite. 101 Dalmatians. The animated one. It's much more better than the uh, sequel that I found anyway. But it was still fun, so, you know, it wasn't... 101 Dalmatians, 101 Dalmatians 2, uh, Patch's New Adventure, and I like them both, but I think the first one was better in the cartoon version, but in the live action version of 101 Dalmatians, I definitely say 102 was a lot better. I don't know why. I think the sequel catched on pretty well with the live action version, but in the cartoon version, I think they, that it was because the song was there, wasn't it? You know, the music was there in the first version of this film. They had the original song to, to, devoted to Qualityville. Qualityville, Qualityville, she is a mean, she is so mean, she will have you instant. I, I don't know the song really well, but Ro I like how Roger sings it, you know. Uh, but. They did actually have the song in the 102 Dalmatians, but uh, but they tried to make it nicer for quite a little sweetener up a bit. I don't know what, what they were going for. There. Um, I hope there's going to be a live action third sequel of the film, 103 Dalmatian perhaps, and maybe on the cartoon, 101 Dalmatians Part 3. 101 Dalmatians free and they'll have a newer title again I hope so maybe it'll be a prequel maybe it'll be a sequel I don't know but I hope they do because these are excellent videos if you haven't watched 101 Dalmatians go and watch it it is one of my favorite dog films of the year uh, along with Old Dogs Who Dem, but I'm on about the Disney version of Old Dogs Who Dem. And well, it is, but you get the picture. This was before Old Dogs Who Dem. Well, it was made before then because the original version was the plant made edition, and it was absolutely made fantastic. Now, if they call Diamond Edition, I think they're rarer. But if they are plantium in addition, they're more easier to get. Because uh, uh, they won't be around for so long. They might even be gone for another 10 years. I say 10 years, 15 years, maybe 12 years they go. Uh, depends on when they leave them in the vault for. Sometimes 10 years, sometimes more. Well, I think they left it in there for 12 years. With Lion King, because uh, I couldn't get hold of Lion King 2, which is which is one of the reasons I needed Lion King 2 to complete my adventure with Lion King. All I had was these two films, Lion King 3 and Lion King. I don't know why, but if you think about it. Without them film, without having Lion King 2, it just isn't a sequel. I know, you're talking too much. <sighs> but come on. Admit it, 
it just isn't the same without Lion King 2. You can't have a collection without the second one. So yeah, that's basically it. So what we're talking about is 101 Dalmatians and 102 Dalmatians, one of the best dog films of the year. Case similar to the uh, thing and basically that. So yeah, another good collection there to have. Um, if you haven't got Lion King or Dalmatians, you're probably missing out a good lot of card classic cartoons. All of our company is my other favourite, and uh, I can't talk about DVDs all the time. So, yeah. Sign out for now, I'll see you in the next vid.